Welcome back, everybody, to a new episode of Sports Headlines and J Jackson Kruger Sports. I am Warner Sanker, and I'm bringing you a brand new Jonu Smith film breakdown. He just signed a, right, a tight end record $50 million contract with the New England Patriots. And boy, oh boy, he is an athletic, fast tight end. Let's get right into this first play right here, Titans versus Ravens in the playoffs. And I, I just want to I want to give you something simple to look at right here. This is his route running. So what he's going to do is he's going to motion over. He's being man-to-man -man coverage by Chuck Clark, and he's just going to run a simple out route, simple four or five-yard out route. Now, here's the thing I want you guys to focus on. When he gets to the top of his right, right route right before he cuts, right about there, right before that little cut, he has squared his shoulders and is looking right at Chuck Clark. His face mask is staring into the soul of Chuck Clark. His shoulders are pointed right at him. And that's key when you're, when you're running routes because you, as a route runner, need to, you know where you're going and the, the DB does not know. That's your advantage over the, over whoever's covering you. So you need to sell it and, and have it look like, you might just be going straight up field. You could go anywhere. That's why you got to square the shoulders and your chest right to him. Then, as you see with John New Smith, you snap your head, turn your hips, and run that out route. And that's a solid four or five yard gain. Uh, and he gets out of bounds. So, really simple right there. I just want to give you a little peek into what John New Smith is like as a route runner. All right. So, the second play I'm going to showcase you guys is from probably my favorite game of the year, just because I'm a Packers fan. Snow game in Lambeau. The Packers are destroying the Titans at this point. But John New Smith is the number one tight end in the red zone. He has the second highest PFF grade and the most, or the, and the, uh, most touchdowns with eight last season in the red zone. And here's one of them right here. So, John New Smith is going to be lined up on the left side in the slot, the left side of the formation. Uh, Ryan Tannehill, of course, in the shotgun. And the Packers have been dominating this game up to this point. And, and, and it's really hard for, for anybody to get their footing, but especially the Titans because they don't play in snow very much, if at all. So at the snap of the ball, Ryan Tannehill is going to take the snap. And Jonu Smith, right here, he's going to be covered by Chandon Sullivan. And... It's a great route because once again, he squares his body up with a defender. He, he takes a step out and runs straight upfield with his, with his hips and shoulders parallel to the, to the back line of the end zone. Then he's going to run a beautiful corner route right there and make a great play on the football. When he squares up right before he makes this cut, he just flips his hips, turns his head, and boxes out Shannon Sullivan with his bigger frame, his stronger frame. He boxes him out and makes the diving catch in the snow, showing off the hands, showing off the uh, the ability to use his big body to his advantage and not just make make it make him slower, and and his route running prowess as well at the tight end position. All right, so Titans playing the Detroit Lions, and this is this is going to be you know exactly how the Patriots are going to want to use John New Smith right here. Um, now, it'll it'll vary whether they have, say, a Mac Jones, they draft a Mac Jones at number 15 or, or another quarterback, or they roll with Cam Newton in his contract as the starting quarterback this season. But we're not here to look at Cam Newton. We're here to look at John New Smith. Smith is lined up on the right side of the line in the slot. He's on the ball. And we're going to see a motion here by the back believe that's Deion Lewis right behind Smith. Now Tannehill's going to snap the ball and Smith's just going to run straight up the seam. And I mean, wow, what a catch there by the big physical tight end. Now Cam Newton doesn't like to stretch the ball down the field. He's more of a short to intermediate passer with, with, you know, okay accuracy, but what a catch. Corey Davis is exactly right. What a catch by the big man, John New Smith. He goes up and gets that. And, and, Running these seam routes, especially at a tight end, tight ends are what NFL teams to you use to control the middle of the field. That's why all these defenses want to find this rangy free safety to control the deep middle of the field and this thumping strong safety to, to control the middle of the field in, in the run game in the more intermediate range. 
So Johnu Smith is going to run the seam route. He's going to get behind the linebacker right here. And this is a cover three look by the Lions. So if you look at, at what Johnu Smith is looking at right here. So this is the route against the covers that Johnu Smith is going to be running here. Um, and he's just running straight up the seam, up the hash marks. And, and this is a cover three look from, from the Lions. So both corners are going to drop back into their deep third. We're going to have the, the free safety staying in the middle, right around the logo in his deep third. And then the linebackers are going to spread out in their, their underneath quadrants. So once John U. Smith gets past that first le level of linebackers, it, the, the, the corners on each side of the field, especially the one on the bottom of your screen that's going to be close to the play here, he, his first read is that receiver. He, go, he reads one to two to three. So he reads the outside receiver to the slot receiver to the running back on this play. That's where he's looking to see who's going to come into his zone. The free safety is going to read the two on each side and then the, the ones and the running back. Because that's the guy that, that that's who's going to be closest to his zone, who's who threats his threatens his zone the most. So John New Smith is the two guy right now. So after the motion of the running back, that sends a check to the safety and the corner to say, hey, listen, there's a guy right behind our number two in, in this tight end, John New Smith, and he's a receiving threat. He's he's not like this big bumbling, and I'm not saying Derrick Henry's a big bumbling power back, but Derrick Henry doesn't have the best hands in the league. So if you are that safety, you have to recognize, listen, we've got, we've got three threats that are threatening our zones, but the corner has to worry about the outside receiver, in this case, Corey Davis first. So the linebacker is going to pass off John New Smith to the, the corner and safety right about there, right when he turns his head to go cover. That's not Deion Lewis, but when he goes to cover the, the crossing route by the running back. So John o. Smith recognizes that and fades a little bit into inside towards the logo of, of Tennessee, towards the more towards the middle of the field. Tannehill throws it and he just goes up and makes a play, takes the hit and brings it in. That is a phenomenal play. That is textbook right there for this big, speedy, athletic tight end. All right. So this play right here uh, is going to feature, it's a goal line play. Now, if you're the Ravens right now, you've got to be thinking, dive right here derrick henry hand it to derrick henry and let him power you through you're on the one yard line the uh pay, the um seahawks should have learned that lesson in giving the ball to their big bruising power back in marshawn lynch on the super bowl so if you're the ravens you're thinking run all the way right you've got um a really three tight end set but there's another offensive tackle on the on the left side of the line number 72 who's got his hand in there and then you've got two tight ends john new smith there circled in red um, is on the inside. You've also got a fullback in the game. So, so heavy package, goal line package. And if you're the Ravens, you're thinking like, listen, you just, just, you know, pound it up the middle, right? Wrong. So it's going to be a play action here. They're going to motion the fullback and they're going to, they're going to basically play it like it's, it's a, it's a, a power concept. So John Smith is going to be faking like he's collapsing the line right here. If you see his hands, he's basically faking like he's collapsing the, the line, sealing the, the edge for Derrick Henry to come through there. Patrick Queen has his eyes right now all over this right here, as does this linebacker. I believe that's LJ Fort. They're both looking right there. Actually, Fort's peeking more into the backfield, so he's seeing he's seeing the, the play action here. Now, after this, after this goes down, John New Smith is going to keep going. He's going to put his hands down and he's going to take off and then make another pretty contested catch there in the end zone. Not the best thrown ball by Tannehill, but he rolls out and throws the ball nicely to Smith who goes up and makes the catch. So, I mean, faking the block and the Patriots love to use their tight ends to block, uh, especially with Damian Harris there coming in and he had a pretty good year last year. So, they're gonna have they're gonna have John New Smith blocking and also being that physical receiver. Think Rob Gronkowski, except I think John New Smith is actually a slightly better athlete, pure athlete than Rob Gronkowski. Not saying he's better as a player, but I think he's faster. He's got better twitch to him than Gronk did. So he's gonna have to block a lot, and this is exactly what the Patriots want to see here. 
Tannehill just floats it over with touch, and he hangs onto the ball through the contact for the score. All right, here, week nine against the Chicago Bears. Jonathan Smith is going to make a great play. So he is actually lined up on the line of scrimmage um, by on the offensive line right here. So that is John New Smith right there. And you've got a trip set right now to the left side. So the Bears have to recognize that there's, they have their coverage shifted over to the right side of the defense, left side of the offense. And that means John New Smith is going to be the main guy for everybody who is on the strong side of the or on the on the right side of the offense, the left side of the defense. But the Titans are, and this is the importance of this of this Shanahan Lafleur um, scheme that about ten teams are running in the league right now, and that is the motions. It forces the defense to make a change, and then you can scheme people open in the holes of the zone. So you've also got to find players with good IQs that can find the hole in the zone. So the receiver's going to motion over, and Tannehill is going to make a change and snap the ball. Now at the snap, John New Smith, no fake of the block. And he's got right now two guys' eyes on him, um, from the two Bears players' eyes on him, right there and right there. So he's he's drawing two men, two guys' attention. And that doesn't matter because in this cover three defense right now that the Bears are running, he gets once again behind the linebackers, which is key and finds the soft spot right in the middle of the zone. This whole area right here is has no defenders in it. So he find, he goes right in the middle of that soft spot, gets the ball, and then here's the run after the catch ability, which is really, really crucial here, especially in this modern NFL. He's going to take that ball from the 22-yard line, and he's going to basically outrun, uh, I believe that was a strong safety, outrun the actually no the nickel corner he's going to outrun him and take it down to the two yard line for 20 yards after the catch only being brought down by eddie jackson and another player um looks like that is roquan roquan smith the linebacker so he's got to be i mean that's basically a touchdown right there he sets him up first and goal on the two yard line for a phenomenal play here's another angle right here so john new smith lined up on the line of scrimmage and he's in his three-point stance, and it's going to be a really simple play. It's just a post route, but the way he runs this is phenomenal. So you've got, he's got Gibson, and then 58 is Roquan Smith, 59 is Danny Trebathan. So at the snap of the ball, Tannehill is going to get it, and uh, Trevathan has to go chase the running back, Derrick Henry, and Tannehill actually makes a really, really good throw out under pressure, and boy, oh, boy, John New Smith just crossed up Gibson right there, number 38 on this route, right here, and just runs away from him. finds the soft spot in the zone, and then brings it all the way down to the two yard line where Gibson has to follow up and make the tackle. All right, and I said earlier that the Patriots love to have good blocking tight ends, and this is a prime example right here. So John o. Smith is circled in red on the right side of the line of scrimmage uh, coming up. And this is just gonna be a, a big, you know, stack the box, um, weak side dive really into the B gap by Der or into the A gap by Derrick Henry. So you're going to have the, the offensive line all blocking left full black back coming right up the A gap between the center and the guard and Derrick Henry following. Now the toughest block on this play is either the center's block who has to make sure the guy lined up right over top of him. He has to push him towards the guard and then go up and get the next linebacker. The other guy who has got the toughest block is John New Smith right here. He's got to hook block the edge defender and seal the edge so that Derrick Henry doesn't get taken down from behind or from the side. Now, as we go through this play, you're going to see John New Smith execute this perfectly. So he gets the ball, and boy, I mean, he he's got he's got. I mean, the 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 play is over for this for this linebacker. It's done. John New Smith has got his hips around. He's got his arm, his hand on the inside of his, of his chest pad, of his shoulder pads. He's got his hands hooked around the shoulder pads in the jersey, which is legal as long as your arms stay inside. That is not a holding call. That is legal. And he's completely sealed the edge so well. Now, Derrick Henry is going to go up, and it's going to be an eight-yard gain. But, I mean, John New Smith blocks this perfectly. And also, here's another thing. He keeps him 
inside that circle the whole time. When the camera's panning over, John U. Smith is not letting up any ground. He keeps the play moving in the direction it should, and he just seals the defender off from the play. He, he knows how to manipulate angles, and he is, he's a really, really smart football player. He manipulates the angle. He doesn't let the defender get around him. If he were just squared up with the goal line at a perpendicular angle with his, with his, chest, uh, with his chest pads, the defender would just be able to you know, basically give him a stiff arm and chase the play. But he gets his shoulder pads and his hips around, Towards, so he's facing really the, the front pylon um, at an angle that faces the front pylon and takes the defender out of the play, which is, which is exactly his job when you, in anyone's job when they are blocking on, an, on, a, on a play. So John U. Smith does a fantastic job of sealing the edge, and Derrick Henry falls forward for eight yards. So thank you all so much for watching this episode of Sports Headlines and this film breakdown of John U. Smith. Thank you all for watching on either Jackson Kruger Sports or sports headlines. Um, be sure to subscribe over here on sports headlines and subscribe to Jackson Kruger Sports on his channel. Um, thank you for watching the most authentic place in sports and peace out.